After the artwork is prepared, you have many tools to choose from for converting your picture to stitches. Each one of these options will be discussed in more detail in additional videos. Color Photo Stitch and Photo Snap are methods used to convert photographic images, as you see here on the slide, into stitches. Photo Snap adds a tapestry effect to artwork, a single color of varying densities of satin stitch. Color Photo Stitch adds almost a stippling type of stitch to the photograph and uses multiple colors. Instant Auto Digitize and Auto Digitize will add filled and outlined stitches to all areas of the artwork. The difference between these two methods is that you have more control with stitch type and sequence with Auto Digitize. There are multiple magic wand tools. Which you use will be determined by the type of artwork and the effect that is desired. The main difference between Magic Wand and Auto Digitize tools is that you get to pick and choose which parts of the artwork are turned into stitches with the Magic Wand. So in this case, with this artwork, I only wanted to digitize the apple, so the Magic Wand was the tool of choice. If you want to process all the artwork, then Auto Digitize can be your tool of choice. Magic Wand Fill Without Holes simplifies the design by only adding stitches to the outside area of the picture. None of the colored areas within the picture are processed if you click on the outside edges only. Magic Wand Centerline is used for black and white pictures and adds a double run to the black areas. It can also be used to process an outline of the picture. Magic Wand Block Digitizing is a good tool to use for narrow areas in a picture where turning stitches can be applied. So you see the multiple stitch angles in this design. So there are many different tools to choose from, and we'll be discussing each one of these tools in more detail with additional videos.